Bank Halftime Show, and our special halftime guest here this evening is Lexi Miller of the Columbia Women. And uh, Lexi, uh, first off, thanks for giving us a little time. Uh, it's always a pleasure to get caught up with the Cougars. Uh, how's things going for you? Um, things are going pretty good. Uh, school, staying on top of homework and exams and stuff. So just things on the basketball court come easy whenever you get your work done in school. Let me ask you about that. I mean, you hear about the balancing act that you have to do between sports and, and academics. For you, uh, what comes first? I would say uh, school definitely comes first for me. Um, I just take a lot of pride in getting good grades and focusing on getting my degree. I know this year has really gotten a lot tougher for me, taking more upper level classes, but I think I'm doing a good job of balancing those right now. What type of major are you in search of? Right now, I'm getting my degree in biology. Um, hopes to become an athletic trainer or I might just end up working in a lab in a hospital somewhere. Well, you don't take the easy way, do you? I mean, uh, talking about uh, biology and stuff like that, uh, that takes a lot of work, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Um, definitely when I'm not on the basketball court, uh, doing homework or finishing I don't know, studying, but yeah. Do you find that going hand in hand where you put in a lot of time studying and then when you can kind of relieve yourself by getting on a basketball court and working out? Yeah, I do look forward to that a lot. Like I'll be sitting in class taking notes and just kind of worrying about getting good grades, but then I realize that I have a two-hour practice later and it's just a nice mental break from having to learn and stuff. And I enjoy being out on the court with my teammates and they're just great people to be around. You're from Macon, Missouri, making the move from Macon or just outside Macon in your case to Columbia. What's that been like for you? It's been a pretty easy transition from where I'm from to here. I mean, I grew up around Macon, which is smaller, but we always came to Columbia to shop or go eat. So I knew my way around Columbia quite a bit, and I don't know. Just the transition from like school and stuff, it's, it's been pretty seamless because classes are still smaller and kind of just how they were in high school. Did that weigh in your decision to come to Columbia, being familiar with the area? Yeah, I think it had a lot to do with that and just being familiar with the area and it's only like an hour away from where I live so lots of family and fans come and support me when they can and I just, it means the world to me. I understand you have one sister, how's she doing? <laughs> She's doing good. She just graduated from HLGU, and she's in her first year of teaching. Um, I think it's going pretty good for her, and I'm excited to see what she'll do and the impact she'll have on kids' lives. Was she an athlete? She was. She played softball. Your mom and dad, they get down and watch a lot of games? They do. They, I think they've been to almost every single one of my games, and if they can't make it, they always have a good reason not to go. Um, but. I'm just so thankful that they can make it to my games and just love and support me every step of the way. Did they make the trip uh, down to Arkansas last week? Um, my dad did, yeah. My mom was working, so she couldn't. But my dad made the long drive, and he enjoyed himself. So it was nice to see him out there and familiar face in the stands. It really goes a long way when you got to support. Uh, your mom and dad, were they athletes? Um, yes, they were. They, they played uh, basketball. My dad played baseball. Um, I. They, they really they coached me throughout my younger years, so that's kind of where I get my athleticism from and my game. But yeah. What's next for Lexi Miller when you're done playing basketball? Um, just getting a good job somewhere. Maybe going to graduate school to get a higher degree. Lexi, thanks for the time. Appreciate it. Thank you.